Hello friends, welcome to Global Online. Friends, in this video we are going to discuss some important MCQs on current affairs for your upcoming NTA UGC NET 2023. So if you are preparing for UGC NET 2023, so you need to go through these current affairs MCQs. The units like ICT, People and Environment and Higher Education System will carry uh, current affairs MCQs and as you all know in paper, paper 1, there uh, paper 1, if you score more, you can easily crack assistant professor examination or JRF. And for your preparation, Global Online has come up with quick revision PDF for paper 1. Here you will get 2000 plus updated current affairs MCQs. Uh, you will receive short notes on all the units. You will receive previous year questions. Most repeated questions are also included here. Here are the one-time one fee payment you have to make for, for this. You have to download the Global Online app from the Play Store or else you can also down, uh, contact these numbers we are also providing paper to material you can contact the same numbers or you can download global online app from the play store now let us move to the questions here the first question is panchamrat term has given by prime minister narendra modi he is related to option a education sector option b environment option c industrial sector option d all of the above panchamrut term this term was given by our prime minister narendra modi and this is related to the environment sector so here option b is the right answer so by here panchamrut means five essential commit, uh, commitments announced by our prime minister narendra modi so called panchamrut it is in, it is it is including step plan for a greener india these plans are massive opportunity for all the sectors and growth of the economy Question number two, what is the rank of India in the recent climate change performance index? Option A 136, option B 135, option C 150, option D 8. The rank of India in the recent climate change performance index that is CCPI is 8. Option D is the right answer. This climate change performance index, India has, India has ranked 8th in the CCPI 2023 in 2022 India's ranking ranking was 10th the CCPI is going to look at the four categories with 14 indicators one is CHG emissions then renewable energy and energy use and climate policy question number three Food Safety and Standards Authority of India is a statutory body established under which union ministry Option A, Ministry of Health and Family Welfare. Option B, Ministry of Commerce and Industry. Option C, Ministry of Consumer Affairs. Option D, Ministry of Agriculture and Family Welfare. Yes, Food Safety and Standards Authority of India, FSSAI. It is coming under the Ministry of Health, Family and Welfare. So, Option A is the right answer. Food Safety and Standards Authority of India. Uh, it is a statutory body established under the Ministry of Health and Family Welfare, FSSAI, recently notified financial regulations and according to FSSAI regulations 2023, it will maintain a food safety and standards authority in, of India fund. And this fund will be uh, will include uh, gra grants given to the food authority by central government. This will be annually audited by the uh, controller and uh, Auditor General CAG. Question number four National Health Claims Exchange has been proposed to be set up by which institutions? Option A IRDI NHA, Option B IRDI Niti Aayog, Option C IRDI with Ministry of Health, Option D IRDI with Ministry of Finance. Here the right answer is Option A IRDI with NHA. Yes, IRDI and NHA National Health Authority are set to develop a national health claims exchange as a digital platform to settle the health claims. And based on a presentation from NHA chairman IRDI uh, Dibajish Panda has proposed to create a working group with representation from the industry. Question number 5. What is the theme of National Doctors Day 2022? Option A. Doctors are guardians. Option B, family doctors on the front line. Option C, respect and dignity to doctors. Option D, insurance to doctors. The right answer is option B, family doctors on the front line. Every year National Doctors Day, it is observed on July 1st in the memory of Dr. Bidan Roy. 
he was the former chief minister of west bengal since 1991 and the theme of 2022 was the national doctors day was family doctors on the front line question number 6 which company launched startup school india uh, initiative option a microsoft option b google option c amazon option d meta the right answer is option b google tech major google announced the launch uh, of startup school india ssi as part of google for start startups initiative and this platform under which google will bring together investors entrepreneurs and programmers and provide opportunities to startups from small cities to interact and learn from them question number 7 which is the first indian renewable energy company to refinance dollar denominated bonds option a sujlon option b renew option c tata power option d adani renewable here the right answer is option b renew yes renew recently became the first indian renewable energy company to refinance dollar denominated bonds this refinancing has cut the inr uh, interest cost of the bonds by 200 basis points question number 8 road transport and highway ministry announced to scrap all government vehicles older than how many years option a 10 option b 15 option c 20 option d 25 here the right answer is option b 15 is the right answer union road transport and highway minister nitin gadkari announced from april 1st all government owned vehicles that are older than 15 years will be scrapped question number 9 savitri bai phule india's first women teacher was from which state option a tamil nadu option b maharashtra option c andhra pradesh option d kerala the right answer is option b maharashtra savitri bai phule was an indian social reformer educationalist and poet from maharashtra along with her husband mahatma jyotiba phule in maharashtra she played an important role in improving women's rights in india question number 10 which indian state launched she auto stands to provide safe transport to women and girl students option a kerala option b andhra pradesh option c new delhi option d odisha friends this question is for you you have to comment the answer in the comment section uh, yes friends for your paper 1 ugc nta net paper 1 preparation the global online has come up with quick revision pdf here you will get 2000 plus updated current affairs mcqs pdf you will receive short notes on all the units you will receive previous year questions most repeated questions are also included here so you have to make a one time payment for this so if you want to buy you can download global online app from the play store you can also contact the given numbers the numbers and displayed on the screen uh, global online is also providing study material for paper 2 preparation here we are providing notes plus mcqs in all the subjects so for this also you can contact these numbers you can also download global online app from play store yes thank you for watching i wish all the best